Okay. Been at our old home site here where we've got zero coins. The snow is uh, starting to melt. The ground's still a little froze. Pretty solid. Xterra 705 with a digger coil. I'm trying to separate between nails. See what I'm dealing with? Well, we got our first coin. A little squeaker. Even I was surprised it was a coin. It's an Indian head. It's not clean enough. First Indian head of 2013. That's awesome. I know there's other coins in here. I knew I'd get a coin eventually. I've been banging this site and banging it hard. So uh, we'll keep hunting. Hopefully come up with something else. Okay, we got another target here. There's a pretty good sound to it. Hunting all metal. This is 3 kilohertz digger, 6 inch coil. We'll give it a dig, see what we got. Alright, we ended up with a piece of iron. You gotta dig a lot of uh, iron using this method, try to target separate through uh, nails and everything else. So you get something that sounds halfway decent, a little bit repeatable, you dig it. On to the next. Hoping you can hear that. Give me a 42, 38, so right in the middle of all that iron. We'll give all right, all your relic counts. What do we got here? I don't know myself. Looks like it screwed on on the back to something. Uh, I don't know. Let me know. You think? Okay, it's still March. I'm at my uh, favorite school site with all the rings and uh, silver coins we got last year. I got my Xterra 705, 15 inch, 3 kilohertz coil tech coil. And uh, still March, so uh, the digging is uh, hit or miss. Some places you can dig, some places you can't. Trying to get some of the stuff that me and Kelly left behind from last year. Hopefully, uh, this combination right here is going to help me. Well, I got my first good target. It's a greenie, down about four inches or so. Not a problem for the coil tech in the Xterra 705. Looks like a Lincoln. Could be a weedy, maybe, maybe not. Can't tell yet. Clean her up at home. Okay, let's play a little game here. Guess what the target is. I'm going to pull off the target with the coil. No change in tone. Tell me what you think it is. 38, 40, solid. Okay. I'm going with... Uh, I'm going to go with a dime, maybe a silver one. Okay, you went with a copper penny, you nailed it. It's a Lincoln uh, Memorial, but it's copper. Copper penny it was. I'm 0 for 1. Hopefully you're 1 for 1. Okay, we're ready to play along again. Pull off. Now drop off in tone. 42 solid. Right there. My guess is it's going to be a dime. I know that's what I said last time, but we'll see what it ends up being. We got a zipper. Okay, I'm over for two. Anybody, anybody nail that with a zipper? Show it a 30. Uh, 
Fishy bats. All right, let's dig her up, see what we got. I'm going to say a penny. Oh, it does sound kind of odd. It's a bottle cap. Well, I have to say, this has to be a first for me. I never really dug the cap from Monopoly before. Maybe it's old. I don't know. I'll have to look them up. See if there's anything to these. Okay, down about five and a half inches or so. We'll get this little charm. Rang up pretty good on, on the uh, Xterra 705. Clean it up, see if it's got anything on it. I'm betting it does. Um, you probably wonder why we're not playing the game anymore. I'm tired of looking dumb every time I'm wrong. I'm always optimistic, you know. You always uh, think you're going to pull out a nice coin when it ends up being a bottle cap or or what have you. Uh, we'll play it some more. I'll get some good targets and we'll All play right, some more. Alright, we ready to play? That's the target I was thinking of. There were several of them here. First I was thinking it was a nickel. I'm going with foil. Foil is what I say it is. I dug an awful deep plug for it to be foil, but we'll see. At first, I was thinking it might have been a nickel, but it was giving me low numbers when we turned the camera on. Dig a deep plug. Of course, it's right on top. All right. Oh, I see something shiny. It looks like a star. Oh, looky here, we got ourselves a charm. Isn't that nice? Now it's a uh, nice little star. I'm not thinking that silver. It does not look silver. But we got the whole chain and everything. We'll clean her up and have a better look at home, but I'm saying it's not silver. It's not foil anyway. All right, ready to play along again? Sounds good, huh? 46 going. Put your guesses in. I'm saying it's a quarter. Alright, let's see what we got. Looking like it's not a quarter, it's a bottle cap. Those bottle caps do sound nice. A lot of times with a double D coil. Wrong again. Okay, down a couple inches here. We've got an interesting little piece here. Don't know if anybody knows what that is. It's a good look at it. It's like a knob or something to something. Can't tell. Clean her up, see if there's any writing on it. See, it looks like an old knob or something. Fairly heavy. Might be lead. Okay. Got the AT Pro out. So I got my brand new 5x8 coil. Been uh, pawing through the nail beds here. Come up with this sign, Ivory Soap. Looks like a nice one. I don't know how old it is. Got a lot of old relics out of here. Um, that's coming with me, for sure.